What's going on guys? Frank Medrano here with Big Boy again from Street Cartel. Yes sir. About to get it in with some back workouts. We're gonna do some deadlifts. It's their deadlift day, so they're gonna he's gonna teach me a few things about deadlifts on form and everything. Hopefully you guys could find some value and, and learn from him as well. Definitely. We're gonna do some pull-ups, more back exercise. Oh yeah. We're gonna kill it. Just follow along and let's go. Let's go. Okay, heavy hitters, so I'm gonna go over some pretty basic techniques, and I'm sure Frank already has a uh, pretty decent technique but uh you know you can always learn so the first thing i was just gonna say is you know you don't want to use too much legs or too much back you want to find um the medium spot where you where you need to be frank has a strong back obviously so i'm definitely not gonna say you know get in this position upright where it's all legs and then we don't want them all back either so you want to get in a position that's going to utilize both your strengths your legs and your back together so you're gonna get in a pretty neutral and a good spot. Find a good spot where you can feel your back engaged and your legs just having pressure. Um, and before you just lift the bar up, I see a lot of people doing this. You know, they just get down, they kind of have their feet set where they want, and then they just pull, you know? When you do that, it can take you out of position. I guess it would kind of be like running to do a pull up and you're just trying to yank yourself up with like momentum. So for me, I like to treat, you know, one plate or if I'm doing 10 plates the same way. So I get in my position, you know, um, I sit my butt down to, to the spot where I want it. I start engaging my lats. And when um, it's just a simple little thing to engage your lats, you're basically like, if your elbows are here, you're basically just moving your elbows a tiny bit and you're engaging your lats. So you're kind of pulling your elbows back a little bit and it's gonna kind of like engage this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're getting your back already working and, and part of the lift. So get in your position, you know, find, find the comfortable spot, engage your lats, pull tension on the bar where you're literally, you know, the bar is about to be lifted and then lift off of that. You don't want to just pull tension, grab it and then lift because the weight gets heavier, you're not gonna be able to keep that form. So you wanna make sure you get in position, tighten your lats, and then put tension on the bar like if this was a bar, like it was literally about to lift off the ground. And when you can feel that, then you explode. Yep, yep. So you don't wanna, so real quick, Frank, like don't think about pulling here, just think about pulling there. Like almost like down. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Yeah.
All right guys, so next we're gonna do some body weight rows using a pull-up bar. We're gonna jump onto a pull-up bar. We're gonna grab an underhand grip, work some more thickness on your on your lats. Uh, we're gonna elevate and put, your, put our knees up or we're gonna keep our legs straight up. Uh, whatever we do, we're gonna pull and we're gonna try to like bring our uh, bar close to our abdomen. All right guys, so we're just gonna jump on the bar here. We're gonna grab an underhand grip. We're gonna put our knees up and we're gonna pull using our back. So we're doing some uh, body weight rows on the low bar. We're gonna keep we're keeping our feet on the ground. Some easier modification for it. Working our lats, chest touching the bar, keeping our body nice and straight. Bad dude right there. Uh, this is also a good exercise for you guys if you guys can't do any pull-ups this is a good exercise for you guys to uh, build up strength in your back to be able to build up for some pull-ups some good reps we're gonna move over to the pull-up bar we're gonna do some pull-ups and we're gonna work on doing some uh, lever raises too to work our lats guys we're gonna go back on the pull-up bar we're gonna do some wide rib pull-ups uh, and we're gonna rip out of those we're gonna focus on good form keep our body nice and straight pull with our back squeeze and come down for reps lever raises now we're gonna uh, engage our back more with these uh, back exercises what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna grab a bar we're gonna keep our, our arms nice and straight and we're gonna press down on the bar uh, keeping our shoulders rounded keeping our core nice and tight our glutes tight point our toes to keep help us keep our body nice and straight in the line and we're gonna press down go up and come back down for reps and it looks like this
right, guys, that was a bad workout. We totally killed it. Uh, big boy and, and his boys came through and they totally killed the deadlifts. You know, they're super strong. You know, oh, yeah. I always recommend, I mean, you don't, you always see me doing body weight training, but it's okay. It, you know, uh, weightlifting and body weight training complement each other really well. Today we did deadlifts, something I'm not too used to, but it works really well, like you, like you mentioned before, with thickness, to, if you want to build some thickness to your back. Uh, yep. We did a lot of pull-ups on the bar, you know, to, to uh, add more width to your back. Yep. Um, a lot of back variations that you could do and you could try for yourself. Comment down below what else you'd like to see next. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe to uh, Big Boy's channel in the description, and we'll see you next time. Hell yeah.